call them letting us do those fun no. things back when I was in school. Man. That would be a fun day, though. Just that would just, be. Just no. dropping stuff off a ladder. Oh, like I, that, can, I can. You, oh. you would be in your yeah. wheelhouse. I can watch that. That's, that's, yes. that's fun stuff. That's mm -hmm. fun stuff. Hey, let's see what's up over uh, Dublin. We have a partly cloudy day out there. And, you know, we have heat going, but the humidity levels not everywhere so high. So we're seeing 91 that feels like 93 here in Dublin. This kind of tells the story. Dew point there, 64. So that's better than like a 71, 72 number, and we've seen that in a couple of spots. That kind of depends on where you are. Another nice night tonight, maybe some 60s, otherwise around 70 to start the day tomorrow. And there is a look at the current numbers. Again, kind of the low 90s, so average high this time of year is 90. So we're just above that by a few degrees in some places. Not terrible. As we look on the board, we see 93 in a few spots, a couple of 92s, 91s. And again, with the dew points, you may see some 70 plus numbers and then some places where the numbers are a little bit lower. So the heat index is not crazy everywhere. Uh, we are seeing some low to mid 90s in a few spots out there. Some places a little bit warmer. All right, so here is the uh, the radar shot. And really, uh, as we go through the rest of today, it's going to be more of what we saw yesterday. Nothing on the radar, but the satellite picking up a few clouds rolling from west to east. And if you look back toward the west here, you can see along the frontal boundary that will be coming in here tomorrow to bring the potential for rain and a few storms to us. You can see a couple of severe storms out that way tomorrow. That would be coming through here. The low end level one threat. It would mainly be for maybe some gusty winds, maybe some small hail with some of that. Not looking for a big severe weather day or anything, but we'll watch them to see if one or two get a little bit gusty. Here's a look at future view, which shows that stuff out west going down to the south. This takes us into tomorrow afternoon, maybe two, three o'clock, popping up maybe a couple of blips on the radar. This is around this time tomorrow. And then as we go on through the evening, trying to slide a little bit east. Now this is tomorrow night. As we go into the later evening hours, there still could be some stuff trying to hang around. There's around midnight tomorrow night and maybe some stuff to the south. After that, once we get into Friday, it's really going to be uh, as far as weather. Where did this front stall out? Did it make its way through our area a little bit more, taking the rain chance more to the east? Or is it going to kind of bottom out here? If it does, then with the heat of the day Friday, the focal point for a shower storm would be in our eastern counties. And of course, football Friday nighters like us are looking at this and uh, we'll keep following the model trends as we get closer in. This takes us into Saturday morning. Long range stuff, maybe a hit or miss, kind of a summertime thing as we go into the weekend both days. As far as the numbers are concerned, some 60s to around 70 in the morning and then tomorrow afternoon we'll say a 93, 94 kind of thing again. Fluctuating humidity, some dark green, sometimes not. And then you can see the front right here trying to come in. This latest model does not show it pushing very far through here, but we'll continue to watch it over the next day or so and see if maybe it'll bring some drier air in. We are hoping that we could get down to maybe 90 or upper 80s as we go through the weekend on to next week. So the best rain chance still tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow night. Ben, back to school.